That's really heartfelt and I appreciate your honesty, Count. <laughs> Is it true that the Velvet Tongue drank your rider during that feedback solo of yours? Yeah, it was true, but um, thankfully they left all the alcohol for us, so that was cool. Because we know they're such softies, you know. Oh, look at Gordon. I think he's had one too many pink flamingo cocktails. Oh, oh man, I feel fun. Oh, oh, oh. No time to wait for tumble Talented bunch our house band for this week, Velvet Tongue. Well, for more reports, um, Velvet Tongue blew you guys way off stage. What do you have to say to that? Oh, for sure. I mean, our drummer used to have purple dreadlocks, and when he played drums, we used to look kind of like animal. And I don't know, maybe we just, we just can't compete with uh, with that sort of fabric skin. What do you think of Guido? Um, yeah, he's sort of like. I don't know, you can never never hear him coming up. It's like you get these bites in the backs of my knees and so. I think he, he's described you as a wanker, like a... Um well I've gotta say he caught me, you know. Uh, I was I was in the public toilet and uh, I was going about my own business and, and he got me and you know it's been all over the headlines. <laughs> so I think. Yeah, I'd um, had a bit of an encounter with, um, what's his name, Guido, yeah, um, behind uh, the, uh, the other band room over there. Oh, this is